The Barbados Association of Retailers, Vendors and Entrepreneurs is one step closer to realizing its almost 20-year goal of establishing a permanent market along the Mighty Griner Highway. President Alistair Alexander said Prime Minister Mia Motley made a commitment to allow vendors and small farmers to use the open field opposite the farmer's Wiser's restaurant as a permanent home when the COVID-19 pandemic subsides. Originally, that area was to be used as a market on a short-term basis after the Barvin Temporary Market at Cheapside the City closed three weeks ago. The open field was an ideal location to give vendors enough room to practice physical distancing while selling produce. He said the facility would be renamed the Barvin Super Outdoor Market. When the market phases into a permanent state, it will house 100 vendors and will accommodate 70 vendors for now. Well, as you know, the because of the COVID, we had to relocate our market, Barve Market. Okay, we have relocated it to Spring Garden. This is preparations for that relocation. We have had the different agencies, the Prime Minister has gone behind it. Okay, and um, she has she has more or less given a mandate to, to do what is necessary to accommodate Barvin in the temporary area. Okay, and uh, also to build up the market to what it should be. So we're gonna have so we are gonna have some work to get done also going forward. Markets must all must not be concentrated in the city. We are living in different times. Okay. And uh, we know that we have a product that the that Barbados love. Okay, and we put it we we're bringing it in an aesthetically pleasing environment. Okay. And uh, they will, they, they, they put, we expect it to, we know, we know we expect it, we know it will be high, highly successful, it's needed, okay. Um, we have future, futuristic plans, we are talking about, we would like it to have solar panels, we would like, we would like also to, to have a, 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 a recycling situation as far as water is concerned, okay. Uh, not only harvesting water, right. But, but also recycling water within the facility. We're talking about also uh, the byproduct, the waste. We're talking about using it even um, in in other in other products, you know, create products with it, and even fertilizer and such like. We we are talking about these things. So there's a there's a lot that we we planning. I, I, there's a lot in my head here now. Right, but there's a lot that we want to do.